Hey, what's up guys? Tech and Tweaks back again with another video. Today I'm going to show you guys 10 free amazing jailbreak tweaks that are compatible with iOS 13.5. Also, make sure you go ahead and check the community tab. I have put a poll on there to see what device I'm going to be giving away. So go ahead and make sure you vote. I'll probably be announcing the winner this Friday on the 29th of May. With that being said, let's go ahead and jump right into the video. All right, so up first, as you can see on my lock screen, we have a tweet called Pokebox. What Pokebox does is basically makes all of your notifications. <laughs> It basically makes all of your notifications look like a Pokemon style notification. So if we go ahead and to the settings of this tweak, tap test notification, it will also type out the notifications, which I think is actually really cool. Not a big Pokemon fan, but this tweak is pretty awesome. All right, moving on. Next tweak we got for you is called Lockdroid. So what Lockdroid does is it basically replaces your passcode with the Android style lock screen. So you've got to draw a pattern to unlock it. So if we go ahead and draw the pattern, it will unlock the device. It's a cool little tweak, not too many settings to configure. Anyways, guys, that one's called Lockdroid. All right, the next one I have for you guys is called Blanca. It is another notification customization. So as you can see, there is like a little leaf style notification. Let me go ahead and enable light mode. So you can adjust the bubble of the notification. So if we go ahead over to the settings of this tweak, there are a couple settings to configure. However, the stock setup, I feel like looks pretty legit. Anyways, guys, that one is called Blanca and it is free. All right, guys, this next tweak is called iPadify and what it will let you do is go ahead and go into picture in picture mode. So if we want to go ahead and enable the picture in picture mode. You just go to the YouTube video, tap on play, full screen it. There's a little picture in picture mode right there. So you can basically go about your business at the same time you're subscribing to this channel and smashing that like button. All right, the next one I have for you guys is called Vesta. It's basically just an app drawer. So if we go ahead and try to swipe from the bottom right, it will bring up a little app drawer. You can search for all of your tweaks, so it's kind of like Android in that sense. So if you're trying to find a certain app because you have tons of pages of apps, you can just come into this app drawer and type whatever it is that you want to find. So there's Snapchat. This is a great tweak for those people that are switching over from Android and do like having an app drawer. Anyways, guys, this one is called Vesta and it is completely free. All right, this next one is pretty cool. It's called Relocate, and what it will allow you to do is adjust your location to wherever you want to be. So as you can see, I'm using this little joystick to adjust where I'm at. It thinks that I'm in Manhattan, which is not the case. However, if we go into the settings of this tweak, we can go ahead and enable it on global, which means every single application on your phone will think that you're in that location or you can do a specific application. Right now I have it enabled for Google Maps. This can also work on Snapchat. However, I don't know if I would recommend that because it may get you banned. Really awesome tweak if you want to troll your friends a little bit. And the joystick feature is absolutely awesome. You can tell them that you're in route to their house or whatever the case may be. This tweet can be really useful for the Find My Friends app if you want to troll your friends and say that you're somewhere that you're not. This is a great tweet to have. Anyways, guys, that one is called Relocate, and it is 100% free. All right, this next one I have for you guys is called Arch, and what it does is it will allow you to individually lock applications. So as you can see, I have my App Store locked, so if I go ahead and try to open it, if it can't scan my face, then it will not let me in. This could be good for messages or any other application that you are trying to be sneaky about. It's a good alternative to BioProtect. Anyways, guys, if you want to send any of that tweak, you can just basically go in and adjust whatever application that you want to have the lock on it. All right, this next tweak is called Dress. 
basically what it does is it allows you to customize your lock screen so if we go into a couple settings on here you can hide the face id lock you can align the x and y axis of different things on the lock screen you can also adjust the opacity if we go to home bar you can hide the home bar notifications you can make adjustments to the notifications basically it's just a really quick simple tweak to allow you to adjust anything that you want on the lock screen to make it fit whatever theme you're trying to get on your device all right this next one is called more bar x13 and as you can see up here in the status bar we have little notifications it will basically move specific apps up there that you preset so if we go into the settings of this tweak scroll all the way down Here's your left notification and right notification. So on the left, I have mailing and Facebook. On the right, I have my messages. It will put a little banner there and a little badge. Really cool, simple tweak, and it is working on iOS 13.5. This last tweak that I have for you guys is called Flex. Flex just allows you to patch certain things on your device. There are just tons and tons of patches. So if we go to trending, you can go ahead and just make tiny tweaks and adjustments to your device. One little patch that I am running on my device is called a verified account with followers. It's just to troll my wife pretty much saying that I have more Instagram followers than she does because she is all about getting followers on Instagram. So if I go to my account, it shows that I have 23,000 followers. She started freaking out thinking that I was verified. The only downside with this little patch is if they go and check it on their device, it will show what your actual followers are. This only works on your specific phone. Anyways, guys, that one is called Flex. Go ahead and download it and check out all the patches that you can do to all the different applications. All right, guys, remember to go ahead and smack that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.